Cogology spent two hours on Tuesday, gathering ingredients for, mixing, kneading, and molding mochi ice cream balls. The idea to teach members and the public how to make the Japanese dessert came from mochi enthusiast and Cocology member Melissa Bach. I really like mochi. I mean, I've, I've grown up like eating it a lot at sushi restaurants, and I've made it myself before, often with my family or just by myself. And I like put fruit in it and just kind of done whatever I want. And I just like how you really, like I said before, you can do anything with it. You can make it fun colors, um, and everyone usually likes it. The lesson was the last of Cocology's four classes this quarter, and for some, the most fun. I really enjoyed making the mochi. Actually, everyone had fun. It was kind of cool. And the mochi turned out really good. I really, really like it. And it's yellow, which is my favorite color. So, yeah. Sometimes when you go for more like ethnic foods or foods that have more diversity in general or that people don't come across, it's just something that you can bring that's new to the community that people haven't seen before. But mochi is also just very easy to make in general. The Culinary Club aims to make baking and cooking accessible, while also providing a welcoming community and de-stressing atmosphere. And we thought that it would be a super cool and super fun thing to teach to people because a lot of times people think mochi is super difficult and hopefully learn today that it is not. It's a more and super fun way to just bond with other people and we're just a really nice group of people who are like won't ever judge you. We're just here to like get everybody together with food and be like here you can follow a recipe and make this. Um, it's not that hard to be a good cook and to feed yourself. This is Alex Wong, reporting for Medill.